welcome to our cooking show. We've got Marisa, Melissa, and Melanie, and Raylan, and me, Lisa. And we're going to be making Nina's Pizza Pie. Where's the powdered sugar? Oh, the powdered sugar, and it got put away. Right. And the can, and the can for the pie filling, I'm not sure where it got put either. This is raining. Okay, we're making enough for two pies. So we got our graham cracker toast. Recipe calls for one cup powdered sugar, so we're going to use two cups. your cream cheese. One package of cream cheese for, for one pie, so we need two packages. Also been sitting out for a little while, so it's very soft. I'm going to be using the cherry pie filling. You can get any brand um, that you. That one says country cherry, and then it's just regular cherry. But you can get blueberry or pineapple or any pie filling topping. It makes for a great, great dessert. Is that okay? I have the cream cheese. Yeah, it should be. 
in that drawer. I don't know if that would work better or not. In the very back? No? Yeah, you could use a hand mixer or a or my hand is the one. It's really quite an um, easy dessert, but yet it's delicious. It's, everybody just loves it. And you can make the crust, uh, homemade crust, or just buy the pre-made, store-bought uh, graham cracker crust. It's great for a workout. Just like the Proverbs 31 woman, she strengtheneth her arms. Okay. <laughs> there you go, Ruth. Work it. I don't have any other cooking utensils. I remember my right now either. It should be fine. Just take a fork or a knife and get that out of there. Go. Fire and just like take the remaining over. And Chef Melissa is gonna probably dip it up into some into the pie into the pie crust, and then Chef Melanie is gonna put the cherries on cherry mm -hmm. topping on top, and Maurice is gonna lick the spoon. Somebody can lick the whisk. <laughs> when Raven gets like bigger, it. she'll lick the whisk. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. And this really doesn't have to set for a long time. Usually we leave it in the fridge for an hour or so. But um, just as soon as it gets chilled through, it's fine to eat. And there you have it. Yum yum. Oops, I should use a different spoon. It's fine. Yep. And that is it, guys. One times one. Seriously, this one to my all time favorite. a dollop of Cool Whip on the very top if you have any left over in your bowl there. You may not. Okay. And that, that will do it. Yay, thank you for having this wonderful cooking time with us today. Come back and see us again soon. Bye-bye.